Welcome and welcome back to Scorpio Tiger's Tarot. I'm Scorpio Tiger. I am here to do the reading, the weekly reading for the sign of Capricorn. I hope everyone is, is week is going great. Let's jump into this. This is a general reading, so take what resonates, leave the rest. You already know what to do if love shows up, reverse the roles as needed. Okay, let's see what's going on. Your raw energy is the queen of swords, okay? Speaking with clarity, cutting things off, setting boundaries. Let's see what's going on with Capricorns for this week. May the 26th, 2024, or whenever they are guided to this message. Those Capricorns that have liked, shared, and subscribed to our channel. Okay. Thank you, sweetie. Thank you. <laughs> and those that are divinely guided here, welcome. Okay. What's going on with Capricorns? I hope everyone is doing well. Capricorn spirit. Okay, thank you. All right, let's see what's going on here. We got the Page of Pentacles in reverse, the Chariot, the Five of Swords, and the Six of Cups. Okay, at the bottom of the deck, we got the Page of Swords. Okay, the Page of Pentacles is looking like your, your money's funny, but it's time for a change or move or something, or you gotta move, and you're gonna, you're gonna, you're definitely going through some changes here. And it looks like everything's going to work out for you, though. I got to look at that reversal. Y'all know I check my reversal. Let me look at this page of pentacles in reversal. Okay. It's unfavorable news. Which probably is going to come in, come in, or you're going to cut things off and move forward. Okay? Defeating your enemies. And um, have some happiness. That's what it's telling you. And it's telling you to stand in your power, Capricorn. Let's see. Why is this page of pentacles here? The Capricorn Collective Spirit. Why is the page of pentacles here? For the Capricorns. It's in reverse, Spirit. Why is it in reverse? And we got the Queen of Wands. Okay, you're liberating yourself and standing in your power. Yeah, putting an end to something, definitely. And this is going to make create some big changes for you. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you're putting the end to something and sitting in your power. I, I, I love it. Good stuff. The chariot. This cancer energy. Yeah, and once you move forward, Capricorn, that's when your happiness is going to come in. Look at there. Good stuff. Okay. Y'all oh, excuse my nails because uh, I ain't had a chance to do them. It's all right, though. Five of Swords. Thank you, Steve. Okay. Yeah, you're going to be able to walk away from these jealous folks. There's some, some jealousy going on here with this Eight of Wands in reverse. And you're going to be able to defeat them and move on. Good stuff. Six of Cups may have something to do with family. Why is the Six of Cups here? Thank you. Yes, you're going to have happiness and peace in your home. Look at there. Yeah. Yeah. That's what it looks like, too. Thank you, Spirit. Yeah. So, you're, you're, you're going to get some unfavorable news. or I mean, you're going to liberate yourself here. Yeah. From something to someone. And you're going to move forward. And that's when your joy is going to come in, Capricorn. Good stuff. Yeah. And all this just jealousy and these naysayers, you're going to walk away victorious. Good stuff. Speaking clearly with that Queen of Swords. And that's going to bring peace in your home. That's absolutely wonderful. Doing what's right for you. Yeah. Big changes. It might be a big blow up, but, but you're going to you speak clearly and say what needs to be said. Good stuff. Love it. Ask your question. Any answers for the Capricorn Collective Spirit? Yeah, you guys are going to be fine. So this week, you're making a decision to move forward, speaking with clarity, and liberating yourself from some situation or something or other. Mm -hmm. Doing what's right for you. Any answers for the Capricorn Collective Spirit? Y'all yeah, forget them naysayers. Mm-hmm. Okay, 
I'm being told to go here. All right. Anything for the Capricorn energy in the spring spirit. Your romance. Love messages. Romance angels. Okay. Okay. Yeah, because you, you liberate yourself from somebody. Thank you, sweetie. See what's going on here. Religious factors, okay? Your love life is influenced by your religious upbringing and spiritual path, okay? Got four cards here. Stay optimistic about your love life, okay? Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance, okay? Romantic feelings. Your feelings are real and worth exploring, okay? Unrequited love, okay? There's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going. And that's why you're liberating yourself from this whole situation, whatever it is. You know your life. Okay, your answers. Peaceful resolution. And helpful people. Okay? Definitely. You're going to be just fine, Capricorn. If you took anything from this reading, like, share, and subscribe. And you guys, I will see you soon. Take care.